So today I'm going to be showing you my Shein review. I did a little try on haul, so I'm going to be showing you those video clips as well. And I'm going to be giving you my thoughts on all of the items you see here today. So let's get into the video. Uh, I'm going to start with bikinis. So let's start with this yellow one. I actually got this yellow one because I got a red, white, and blue one from them last year. I, you know what? I could be wrong. I don't know if I got it from Shein or Zappel, but I got a red, white, and blue one, and it was super cute, so I knew I wanted it in a different color. So here are the bottoms. They scrunch up as much as you want to cover the back, so I thought that was really cute. And I didn't know if I was going to like the top style because it just like ties around like this. I'll show you in the try-on video. But um, yeah, I really love the color and I will end up taking out like the little padding in the bra. Um, I just think that they fit better without it. So at least with this style of bathing suit. Um, yeah, but I love the color and I'm definitely going to be wearing that on one of my next tropical trips. So next we have the red bikini. Um, the only thing is, okay, so unlike the yellow with the string bikini, this has a little bit more, um, a little bit more width to the sides, and it is a little bit more conservative, um, but you can kind of see the white lining when you're wearing it, so I don't know if you'll be able to tell from the, the try-on video, but I think I might have a little bit of a hard time with that when I'm wearing it out at the beach. I don't know, I'm going to have to like give it a go and see how I like it, you know, while I'm wearing it out. But I really do love the top, so I'm going to have to check on that next time I go to the beach. But I love the color. Um, another one that I got is this white set. This white set came with three pieces. It's this triangle top and this bottom, which the bottom is similar to the red bottom. Um, but because the lining inside is white and the outside is white, you don't really have that issue, right? So, um, yeah, it came with a three-piece. This um, cover-up is pretty thin and very sheer, but I really like the little tassels at the bottom. I thought it was super cute. Um, I can't wait to throw that on with, like, a little straw hat or something. Um, this one is probably my favorite. Um, it has this two-tone, one-shoulder top. Isn't that so cool and different? I'm... So excited to wear this one out. I got them all in size small, by the way, in case you're wondering. Um, and this is the bottom, also two-tone. It's a bit of a high leg, and I really like it. I cannot wait to wear this to the beach or to a nice, you know, pool on a layover or something. So, yeah, really like this set. Next, I'll show you the one that I'm wearing right now. It is this lounge set, which I really love. Only negative is that it is a little bit sheer. So if you do decide on getting one of these sets, either try and get a different color or you're going to have to definitely wear some kind of nude undergarments because it is pretty sheer. So keep that in mind. But they are so sleek looking and really pretty. I wish I got it in another color, but I didn't know. I probably would go back and get it in a different color now. But yeah, I really like them. I've already, I've already worn them once yesterday and now today, so yeah. I also got these pajamas, which are like a silky set, kind of like a Victoria's Secret dupe, I would say. Um, the bottoms are like, they have this scrunchy top, super cute fit. I'm definitely going to wear these to bed. Um, yeah, I mean, what else can you say about them? They're silky, they're cute. Easy, easy yes for me. Okay, so next, I this is the first time I purchased sandals from Sheen, and this is what they look like. I think they're super cute um, to walk around the beach, um, what else, somewhere in a bikini. Um, that's the reason I got these specifically, because they are just see-through with little rhinestones. I thought they were super cute. Um, I got these in a size 7, which I think I would have preferred a 6.5 because they're a little bit too big, but... They're not that big, so I'm still going to be able to wear them. I think that, I'm hoping, because these are a little bit um, stiff right now, hopefully after a few wears that they will loosen up and fit a little bit better around the foot. But yeah, I thought they were super cute. Okay, next I'm getting into dresses. I actually just did a 
little photo shoot with DJ yesterday. We went to downtown LA. If you guys want to check more of the photos of these outfits, they're going to be on my Instagram. But I still did a little try on for you guys here as well. So this is the first dress. It is a, is it, it's above the knee. I think all of them are above the knee length. I really thought this dress was really cute and classy and it had like, I don't know, just like a vibe with it. But the only thing is that the sleeves were a tiny bit long, so I just like kind of pushed them up like this and that worked. Um, another thing, I got this in a small and it was a bit loose. It's just to you guys if you wanted to get it. This one I would go maybe a size down, only because it's, it's just really loose on me. So that's the only negative. I'm still gonna wear it because it's cute, but next time I might put a belt on it or I don't know, what else could I do? If you guys have any ideas, let me know. This one is another one that is a bit big. It's just like this blazer kind of style dress. I put this black belt with it. I haven't put them on together, but I'm thinking I can like cinch it at the waist so that it fits a little bit better. I'm hoping anyway. But it was really cute. The sleeves are a little bit like sheer, which is super cute. Um, what else can I say about this? I don't know. It just reminded me like business look. And that's something that I've been looking for lately. So I'm going to wear this with like closed toe pointed black heels. Super cute. I just hope it goes well with this belt. And if not, I don't know what I'm going to do. But yeah, these two, I would both, both of these I would suggest getting in a size down. Because they were both a little bit too big. Next we have this one sleeve poof like tighter dress. Which I actually love. It has this little tie on the side. With this long dangly tool. Um, this dress fit perfect and they're all a size small so I'm not sure why the other ones were a little bit too big but this one fit great. I would recommend getting your size in this um, but yeah it was so beautiful. I took a lot of photos in this so you're gonna have to check those out on Instagram but I absolutely love this dress. I'm definitely gonna be wearing it again so yeah keep a lookout for that um, but yeah that's that about that dress. Oh, this was just a little bit too long, so even with heels, this was kind of dragging on the floor. So, I mean, I guess I could trim it up if I wanted to, but I just left it and it was fine. Um, and last but not least, this one's my favorite from this purchase. Um, I've been looking for a dress like this since Kendall posted in a bright pink dress. I think a couple years ago and it's just been on my mind forever so when I saw it on Sheen I thought you know what I have to have that dress it was a great price um, and it is super super cute I wore this yesterday and I felt like just like a princess and it was like I was the center of the world it's just such an eye-catching piece and I absolutely loved it they had it in bright pink and white I think but I got the the light pink which it, it kind of looks a little bit peachy um, but it was so beautiful on I'll show you the front and the back I steamed all of these dresses because they do come a little bit um, wrinkled but it is it was just so beautiful you guys I would highly recommend this dress it is so fun and so cute um, yeah it was my favorite one. Oh, it is a little bit itchy but other than that perfect Okay, I didn't want to forget to mention this, is the bow had a tiny little cut. I don't know if you can see that right there. Um, which, I mean, I'm not going to return it just for that tiny little thing because the rest of the dress is absolutely perfect. But, I mean, it is a discrepancy and it should not be there. So that's something to know. I've never had any other issues, but yeah, that's just a light, little tiny thing to know. And it is right in the front of the dress, which... Uh, it could be a bummer, but I'm just going to keep it and I'm still going to rock it no matter what. But yeah, this one was definitely my favorite. So for a final little overview of what I thought, um, this dress, loved. Probably my favorite. This is going to be like a close second favorite because I loved it. Definitely going to wear both of those again. Both of these dresses, I like them, but they just didn't fit perfect, so... I'm going to try and figure them out, but I will probably still wear them again. Um, pajamas, cute. Going to wear them. This lounge set is cute. Just a little bit sheer, so I'll probably just keep that in mind where I'm going to wear it to. 
Um, love this bikini set. Definitely gonna wear this. I'm definitely gonna wear all the bikinis just to like see how they fit and like wear at the beach or at the pool. Um, but yeah, this one was my favorite. White is just the classic, so I'm probably gonna wear that. Uh, the red, I really love it, but I'm worried about the bottom, you know, showing the white inseam, but we'll see. And the yellow, so bright and pretty. Love it. And the shoes, like I said, they're going to be super cute for the beach or, you know, hanging around. So that's the end of today's video. I hope you guys liked it. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel. If you guys want to follow me on Instagram, my handle is at Heather King of the World. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.